Hey folks, how you doing? So, I just arrived at the Tree of Life. It is a bumpy ride, a long ride uh, to get here, but definitely uh, something you want to check out when you're here. I was hoping to catch it on video. I uh, just had an encounter with a drone flying by. I don't know whose drone, but definitely uh, impressive. I couldn't tell if, I mean, when, I'm, when I say drone, not like a small drone, a big drone, I don't know if there was anything on it, but maybe it was just doing some aerial photography of the Tree of Life. So we have, as we come up down here, we have what looks like some well, uh, relax area, sit down, because I can't even begin to tell you how hot it can get here in the summertime. So definitely some pictures, some writing about it. Uh, it's in metal, so unfortunately it's a lot of it's rusted away. Um, but if anything, it's a nice heck oh 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 chamber huh um yeah that was funny um place to relax in the summertime a trash bin thank goodness hopefully hopefully there's the garbage is cleaned up i'm hearing rumbles in the background I don't know what that is. Maybe it's uh, drilling going on. I have no idea. Uh, so if you look off in the background, you see lots and lots of oil wells. Of course, this is uh, the main source of revenue for the country of Bahrain, oil. I think the excess, the fires you see is uh, the byproduct of the oil being extracted from the wells. So that's what we, you were seeing. There it goes again. It's pretty consistent, whatever it is. I don't know if the audio is picking it up. It almost sounds like a bombs, but I don't know. Yeah. This is the tree of life. We'll get up there. Don't know the entire story, but from what I've been told, it's a tree that grows without any water. Or there is no water source around, as you can clearly see. No water source around for miles. <laughs> Again, this is a very popular area for people to come visit for the day um, bring um, oh hang on sorry we have other uh, different areas to other trees this is the angel tree oak south carolina usa and this is how far it is from there Canary Islands again how far so this is it's a cool little interesting facts Ooh, the, the lone the lone cypress in California it's a long ways home Mexico families come up here maybe have a picnic or something uh, I 
Weather is definitely nice today. I think, I don't know if there is like a clear path. I think you just, whatever, whatever you take, you take. A nice little tree of life center. All right, cool. We'll get, we'll take a break once I make my way up there. Uh, start up again. Okay, so we made it to the top of the hill. Not a very big hill. Uh, again, this is the tree of life. Uh, with some birds. That's not a woodpecker in the background. That's drilling. So, you can see its branches go out pretty far. Uh, I don't know how much shade you're going to get in the summertime. But thank goodness it's a cloudy day. You don't need a lot of shade. Looks like they have little lights set up. Never been here in the evening. Um, when the lights are turned on. But I'm pretty sure it's probably pretty pretty cool to see uh, I don't know if there was a house here or something built here before but uh, definitely it's still growing it's not dead so that's good <laughs> I'm not gonna go climb it looks like it's definitely seen its fair share of destruction or just wear and tear just from being so old uh, I think those are from woodpeckers <laughs> pecking away for poop the thing about winter time in the Middle East is you get lots of bugs all the flies come out but there we go tree of life <laughs> uh, there's a lot more to do out here I'm sure uh, I'm sure there's nice restaurants in the area go have a bite go get something to eat but uh, uh, maybe if you got dirt bikes or four wheelers bring them out here maybe there's people renting them or something Come out here, enjoy the day. Uh, if you're coming from Manama or Jafar, it's gonna be a, a good 30 minute plus, 30 minutes, just keep it safe, 30 minutes from Jafar. Uh, definitely would not take a taxi. If you get out here, a taxi brings you and he leaves you, good luck on getting back because there's not going to really be a taxi to come back out here and get you. So just, if you got a license that works, rent a car, come out here for the day. Because a taxi is going to charge you uh, probably close to $100 just to bring you one way. If they, can, if they can trick you into paying it. But yeah, it's a popular place. A lot of people come out. Uh, but yeah, I recommend if you've got the time, come out and check it out. It's a nice, it's a nice day trip. But anyways, I'll let you guys enjoy. This is life as I view it. Have a nice day.